opposition from Senate Republicans. When you take money from the private sector in the form of an income tax, there is less money for people to expand their businesses, to invest in assets, to pay for college. Those are the things that make the economy grow and expand and produce more jobs over the long term. Both the House and the Senate favor some use of permanent fund earnings, but don't agree on just how to do that. And in the middle of all of this, we have next year's elections to pass new... Natasha! It's interesting on um, September 10th, 2018 Frontiers... You mentioned that an income tax is bad for Alaskans and bad for business. Then how come in the past four years you have um, decided that people and Alaskans should have less of a permanent fund dividend? Therefore, you actually did support a tax to tax Alaskans for the past four years. You have contributed to stealing from a family of four $28,000 for the past four years. Let's uh, let's rewind the tape and see what Natasha said um, about this. We'll play it again. Right now, an income tax faces stiff opposition from Senate Republicans. When you take money from the private sector in the form of an income tax, there is less money for people to expand their businesses, to invest in assets, to pay for college. Those are the things that make the economy grow and expand and produce more jobs over the long term. Both that and the Senate favors some use of permanent. Why, Natasha? Why do you say one thing in front of the cameras, but your votes tell a different story? Natasha Van Emhoff takes your permanent fund dividend money, South Anchorage. You need to replace... Uh, Natasha Vanoff with somebody else. Who? As long as his name's not Jeff Landfield. Because he believes in taking your permit fund dividend money too. All right. South Anchorage, you could do better than Natasha Vanoff because we know she's a liar.